like near, uh, you know, the wall on the east, uh, uh, in the inner wall, uh, but they have to have a special permission. And uh, if you want to go to visit them, if they were like your friends or your family member, you have to ask for uh, permission from the police. Uh, why it was different the situation in the west where people could uh, move uh, you know and could walk like close to the wall in fact uh, this is the reason also why uh, in the west there were like a lot of graffiti you know and most of the graffiti we are actually in the british sector and uh, what happened is that uh, uh, they had a lot of rubbish you know around and uh, uh, they had to find a solution also what to do with this rubble, but they have to find a solution within the West. Why? Because there was the Berlin Wall around. So what they decide to do? So they decide to cover it up with the uh, rubble from the Second World War. Volksberg tour. It was one of the best tours that I've had not only in Berlin but anywhere in any city. It was a real behind the scenes look at a really important part of history. Not only was it pretty awesome to go inside but there was so much artwork everywhere, loads to see and there was lots of nice little tidbits along the way from our tour guide so I really recommend it. Yeah, it was um, unreal. Yeah, I've uh, never seen anything like it. Um, definitely one of a kind. Check it out. Definitely go check it out. Tour and it's just, it was just like the best 15 euro I just spent. It was all I, all I love. Street are like a very glimpse into the like um, the Berlin uh, counterculture with all the graffitis, all the historical. So if I want just want a hint for you guys, just go for it. It's definitely worth it.